This is brand new from Manhattan, New York. So I decided to throw on a stocking cap that I made about about two or three years ago. And I really like it. <sighs> so I custom made this stocking cap. As you guys can see, the closure. I didn't have a closure. I made a closure because y'all know I do here. So I made a closure. As you guys can see up here. Um, I made a closure and I like the color of the hair because it's it's a number four so it's not the lightest brown that they have but brown goes good with my complexion if you guys can see that brown goes really good with my complexion it's a body wave it's a body wave so it just has like light bouncy curls um, because this is synthetic hair you can't curl it with a flat iron because it's already curled so you can't curl it with a flat iron and you can't um you could like use like um what do you call it you could use flexi rods um or the other small rods that come with like some moves but then again remember that the moose will make the hair heavy so it'll weigh down the hair if you add mousse to it and then you don't want to wash your stocking cap too often being that you use glue to bond your stocking cap because I didn't sew down my webs I glued my webs so yeah and I I've done this stocking cap like three years ago I did it in my house it's on um so if you guys can see oh there's some natural light so i made my own closure as you guys can see up here i made my own closure um yeah it goes really good with my complexion you guys know i'm mrs wiggy i love throwing on a wig so it doesn't matter what i do to my natural hair because i always throw on a wig <laughs> even though i do take care of my natural hair i always 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 go on a wig because i love wigs um so i'm on my way to class now and y'all i woke up last night like i'm just like showing more and more every day that i'm pregnant <laughs> like every day my bump gets more pronounced so it's like kind of cool and week by week I see changes. I'm like lethargic. Well, I'm up. I'm, I'm like up. I want to do like a million things, but I have untimely nausea. And I'm like throwing up all the time. I don't have, I don't have like morning sickness. I'm just like anytime I smell some shit funny, then later for sure, I'm going to be puking. So. That is my new, new, new lifestyle. So, and then I don't be feeling like putting on makeup because I'm lazy. So, being that it's winter, my skin complexion is just like so glowing. Um, and you know, winter usually makes your skin more paler. So my skin is like so glowing and I'm really loving it. So yeah. So yeah, I custom made this unit on my head and then I took it off immediately. I was gonna sell it. A lot of people were like, oh, you know, they were like, I'll pay you any amount of money. People wanted to pay me $3,000 for this unit. I'm just like, whoa, the hair is not even, the hair is not human, y'all. This is, this is synthetic hair. Like, it's not, it's not human hair. It's like 110% fake hair. So, it's just like, so I'm just like, ah. So, I am... I'm drop dead gorgeous and I know it.
and I'm fabulous. But yeah, y'all. So I didn't cut the bangs because I like sweeping the bangs from side to side. So right now I kind of like twisted it up over here and put a like scrunchie there. It's not um and put like a scrunchie here. It's not um it's not it's not um cut like how you would cut a bang I didn't cut the hair at all except for the ends because the hair was 14 inches and I did not feel like dealing with 14 inches of hair so what I did was I cut the hair and it's like right now it's like 11 inches and I like the length but I didn't um like cut a bangs or cut like a front piece you guys know how you use the shears and you cut the front piece or something like that i didn't do that um so i am fat y'all can you guys see this can you guys see this can you guys see this so I am fat, y'all. Oh, outfit of the day is my Via Springer jacket, my Uggs, Uggs. Um, my coach bag, because I could carry my notebook in it. And I don't ever really, otherwise than that, wear this purse because it's, like I don't usually ever otherwise than that wear this purse because it is um because it is it just looks like a like a um like a traveling bag it doesn't look like a purse it looks like if you're gonna run errands or something you wear it but it doesn't look like a purse to me so um but it was pricey it was like 150 dollars for this bag it comes with two pieces it comes with a bag that actually holds this bag is bigger than that so it but it was it was in the travel section as a I'm about to sit down y'all because I'm waiting for the local bus so I could go up to the bank so I could be able to buy uh, um, a monthly metric card So the bus isn't so the bus isn't in service yet. And like I say y'all, I am like as days go by, I am just like as days go by, I am like getting bigger and bigger. So and I don't even have that much time because my first class at eleven. My first class is 11 to 12.15, and right now it's 9 o'clock, so I tried to leave my house a little earlier than 9, I didn't feel like putting on any makeup, so I just threw on a wig, a stocking cap, wig that I made myself, and it's so much better when you make your wig yourself because you get the exact color you want, the exact hairstyle that you want. You know, it's kind of so annoying when you buy pre-made wigs because you'll be like, oh, I want that hair, but I want it in a certain way. I want it in a certain, you know, whether you want it straight and it comes curly. So, like, this year I went to the store. I picked out, for those of you who don't know about um, stocking caps, you buy the glue. Um, next time I'm making a stocking cap, I'll try to film for you guys. You guys can check my channel. I have videos where I actually make stocking caps from scratch. So you can check out my channel. You can see that. Um, but I'll give you guys an updated one for this year. Because I haven't I haven't really done anything arts and crafty. Or like where I had to focus. Like focus and make it and enjoy it. Because I made it. So you know. I'll try 
try to get that up to you guys like pretty soon. Um, yeah, like this morning, I was like all puky. I was puky this morning. Like I was literally throwing up this morning. Um, so yeah. So I'm just sitting here. It's raining in New York City, you guys. It's actually raining. I don't know if you guys can see that behind me. Can you guys see that behind me? Can, can you guys see that behind me? It's raining. So. Oh, and I didn't tell you guys. I got four tickets from MTA. Like, it's just ridiculous. I mean, it doesn't even make any sense. It's like obviously stalking because what is the odds that you would get four tickets in less than a month back to back? Like that's just it, it's not it's not feasible. That has to be something else going on because there's no way it's not even not even twenty days from the first ticket. The second ticket less than a week later. The ticket after that is less than another week later. And the ticket after that is less than another week later. So Uh, they finally gave me a court date on the spot this time. <laughs> like, dude, I'm getting tickets in front of you. Hello. <laughs> so they gave me a court date on the spot this time. Before, they were just like, call because you're pregnant. Go at your own, you know, go at your own leisure. And tell them that you're not working so you don't have any source of income. And they'll do something to help you with that. Um, so I'm like, because it's obviously the biggest problem, um, you know, for me. So, and I don't see anybody's going to cut some checks for me and give me free money. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, it seems like the next bus went up, but it didn't, um... Yeah. Oh, this bus is this bus is about to go. This bus is about to take off. I just sat down, y'all. Y'all, I'm I'm actually like I have like mad energy, but I'm getting tired at the same time. So I'm going through two different things because I'm bright eyed and furry tail like all the time. But then I'm like, no puke. <laughs> So thumbs up this video, share it, like it, subscribe to my channel, stay there to me and my life. Be blessed, I'll do the same. Again, this is Ronnie from Manhattan, New York. Mwah!